Is uh, shooting 52% from the floor. Nice work so far from them. And Davis gets it to go. Awesome job by AD to get the ball in a favorable spot. That's most anywhere, but comes up big with that basket. Quickly against Russell. And it's quickly missing. Lakers have gone 5 of 11 from the field in the fourth quarter. To tie it up. Russell dishes to Davis. That evens the score. Davis has got 22. Well, you combine AD's length and his skill, and when he's on like this, he's unstoppable. Barnes up top. Covered by LeBron. Good on the shot. Gigantic basket by Barnes. This guy's not afraid. James looking around. Yeah, easy call. And a look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for Toronto. They bullied the defense here in the paint. Look at all of those buckets inside. Just hard to defend in the paint. And another difference maker that we could point to tonight has been second chance points. They've been in there. They've had active hands. They've been in great position. And they've been smart attacking the offensive class. He drops the first one, and that narrows the gap to one. The feel LeBron has for the game, unreal. In whatever situation he finds himself in, he always seems to have an answer. And James drills them both. And yeah, not the guy that you want to put at the line in these moments. He's not missing these. And it's Barnes with the ball for the Toronto Raptors. They led by as many as 18 points. Quickly with a wide open look. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. The Lakers shooting it well here in the fourth quarter. 50%. James with a deep three. No luck that time in the shot that would have put them on top. And here's Barnes for three. It falls for his seventh bucket of the contest. He's seven for nine. He's a guy that lives for a big moment like that. Great focus and courage in the clutch. Here's LeBron. It counts. And that shot brings them to within just one. That is world class. Love seeing that there. A huge possession. And he nets it. Barnes down low. Working on James. Can't connect from short range. Reeves in the corner. 34 seconds left to play in the final quarter. Davis setting the pick for Russell to the inside. Purple with the steal. And so they foul intentionally. This is a huge possession. And this is where all the hard work pays off. You have to be able to execute under pressure. Good on the first, and that will put them up by two. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a three-point game. Well, important there to have the three-point lead because only a three can tie it up now. And J.J. Redick is called timeout. Coach clearly feeling the necessity to regroup with so much at stake here. There's 25 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. It's rebounded by Scotty Barnes. They're going to prolong the game here with an intentional foul. Yeah, you, you can't let them hold the ball and just milk those last seconds away. First free throw is good, and that gives them a four-point cushion.
and the second free throw. No good. A tough break there. No time to waste on this possession. Time is not on their side right now. They're aware. Frames it from downtown. Well, the teammates are fired up, and so is D'Lo. They foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. No choice but to foul there, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line. And the first of two, no good. Heartbreaker. And you look at Grady Dick's physical gifts, and you see it's all there. Size, length, careful training, and hard work could make him into something special. There's 10 seconds left in the game. James outside. Oh, off target. the first one and that narrows the gap to one can't sink it and that was an important free throw and now they foul and stop the clock So the first one drops, and that will put them up by two. And so both free throws are good, and it's a three-point game. And so the big win by Toronto in a tight game. That was a fun night of basketball and fabulous finish as they continued to wait out until the very last moment to seal it. And there are so many times when you see these tight games won at home.